All right. I'm out in the woods. It's, it's a nice day. It's, it's over 50 degrees. And really what I'm doing is I'm scouting around for a place to let some of my tadpoles go next year. And I found this little spot here that uh, it's kind of off the beaten track. I, I myself hardly ever get to this little corner. And it, this this pool here seems deep. Like like maybe it's been here all year. Maybe this holds water all year. Because the last thing I want to do is you know throw them somewhere where uh, where they're gonna get all dried out. Uh, I spent much of last week. Very sick, very sick. I haven't been sick like that for for years. I had a temperature of 103 degrees, over 103. Uh, it was so bad, the old lady. She says, "I'm going to take you to the hospital." No, no, I'll be all right. You know, stubborn, stubborn man. Uh, so bad that I only got 29 hours, and. Uh, as a lot of you know, sometimes, shit, I'll do that in two days. I'll get 29 hours Monday and Tuesday. So, it's nice to not be very sick again. But I've been working my way through here today and, and cutting out some of the vines. And just sawing on them goddamn vines. I'm, I'm running out of, uh, having to stop and take rests. And sweat my ass off. I probably got a little bit too much clothes on for a 50 degree day. But, uh, Jesus, I was really sweating my ass off there for a minute. I had to stop. Drank almost my whole bottle of water already. So now I'm ready to get out of here. I got a little bit of a hike to get back to the truck. Uh, and this is it. Anyways, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try and remember this spot. There's a couple of real big cottonwood here. And uh, and yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna let hundreds of them tadpoles go here because there really doesn't even seem to be toads out here anymore like like there used to. I don't know. I can't understand it. We we must have had uh, some very dry years where you know nothing that depended on the water for breeding. That, that they weren't able to. I've talked about the the uh, salamanders back in here before, and, and you know they're not here anymore either. So I don't know. It's a bit of a mystery to me. I don't know what happened to them. Uh, as far as YouTube goes during the week, yeah, I was looking in on things, and, and uh, I don't know. There's fucking drama going on between I don't know who I. I I didn't insert myself into any of it. I see, you know, all the usual people are involved. Uh, that fucking dumbass Douglas, uh, of course, makes a video regarding three, four different people. Uh, I guess I'm just staying out of this one. But I, you know, I don't know if anyone has noticed it or not, but I haven't really been commenting. This morning I commented a little bit on a couple of videos. Of, some of the people that don't get too many views, I, I try and watch their videos. Uh, but yeah, that's it. I, I was very, very sick. So sick, I was thinking about smoking, not stopping smoking. Uh, there was a couple of days where I only had about three cigarettes a day. Hard to believe, but with a 103 degree fever, I would drag my ass out of bed go on the porch in the freezing cold and, and have a cigarette. That's how bad that, that addiction is. Uh, so I'm going to amble my way out of here. Uh, go home and probably make some soup, get into my PJs. And, I don't know, I got a couple books I may start. Uh, 
I may just get on YouTube for a little while. <laughs> when you're real sick like that, when you have a, a bad fever, you have the weirdest dreams. And I had just finished a book uh, Monday night. I went to work Monday. I worked 11 hours Monday. But I was coughing. I knew I had something. And uh, I went home and finished a book. Uh, it was kind of a kind of a biography, uh, not his entire life, but the years when he was flying uh, about Rick Tovin. And uh, so, so Monday night, all the dreams that I had had something to do with that, you know. And, and you would get up and. and, and think, damn man, what a fucking weird dream and go back to bed and, and pick right back up the same fucking dream uh, I don't know I, I felt like I had more to say here uh, especially regarding that drama shit but, but fuck that, fuck that stuff I think I'm gonna sign out I'm gonna show you the water one more time if I can pick this up without shutting it off thing about the water here as you can see on the trees there the high water mark so this thing is another foot deep and I can see high ground in that direction and there's nice high ground over here that I can come walking in on and I can let them tadpoles go right into this deep water in the woods where they should be not in my backyard you know I want some in my backyard but every year I get I get thousands of them and last year was a good year for them I think but uh, a lot of years a lot of years there's probably 80% of them just die okay that's it I'm out